Cannot accept change invalid input message on the TI Inspire graphing calculator. I was embarrassed in my classroom earlier this week and this is what happened. This was a fail. Fortunately, this was at the end of a 90 minute class period when the students were pretty tired after having gone over a lot. The students were quite forgiving. That's their nature and I appreciate it. In finding a quadratic function using three points, this is the equation we determined. And we entered it in the function line of a graph page on the TI Inspire just like this. F1 of x equals negative 0.1284x times quantity x minus 45. But after having set up the window in advance to get a beautiful parabolic arc recreating a rocket flight path and pressing enter to graph, this is what I got. A big fail. Cannot accept change. Invalid input. I tried retyping the equation over a few times, even using different inspires, but still got this error message. After briefly speaking with someone with a lot more experience on the TI Inspire who did not have an instant solution, I thought to call 1-800-TI-CARES as I have done many times previously. This time apparently the load on the technicians was so heavy that there was a non-technical customer service representative who took my phone number and told me that a technician would call me back when available. While waiting for the TI representative to call me, I played around with the equation to try to get it to work. I finally found something that did work. Look at the x variable right after the digit 4 just to the left of the parentheses. All I did was this, and you'll need to observe carefully. I placed a multiplication operation here right after the first x and in front of the parentheses. When I multiplied after the x and before the parentheses, the calculator also placed a multiplication operation in front of the x as well. Here is the x without the multiplication operation, and here it is with the multiplication operation with the dot symbols meaning to multiply both in front of the x and behind that first x. Here are the window settings I used to optimally graph the function. I got here from the graph page by going to menu then down to option 4 which is window slash zoom then pressed enter for option 1 window settings then I tabbed down for x min of negative 10 x max of 50 x scale of 10 y min of negative 10 y max of 75 and y scale of 10. After pressing OK, this is the graph we intended to get before being delayed by the error message, beautifully filling the view screen of the calculator. One advantage of the TI Inspire is shown here with the function being placed with the graph of the function made possible with the extra resolution of the TI Inspire calculator view screen. What was it that caused this error message? As best I can tell, with no multiplication operation between the x and the parentheses, the calculator sees the entry line as a part, a line of text, and not as a function to be graphed. And since the calculator cannot accept a function that is text, it gives this error message. Don't be too upset about this, and other oddities will discover about this new technology. As users such as myself discover them and can explain them in videos and in websites, we'll get through this and become more successful at using this calculator. This has been Cannot Accept Change Invalid Input Message on the TI Inspire Graphing Calculator. Thanks for viewing.